I think if there's one historical artifact Marquette residents would like to see restored more than any other, it might just be the Front Street Railroad trestle. It was actually the second trestle that went over Front Street. The first, which sat a whole lot lower, fed DSSNA Dock Number 5. But when they built Dock 6, which is the one that still sits in Lower Harbor, they needed a bigger, higher rail line. And the one they started to build in 1931 was pretty massive. It started its climb between 4th and 5th Streets and wound its way through a big chunk of downtown. By the time it reached the docks, it was almost 80 feet above the ground, supported by a scaffolding of wooden support beams, and was one of the defining structures of Marquette. They stopped shipping ore from the dock in 1972, and the trestle just sat there. The portion of it that ran over Front Street became kind of a billboard greeting both residents and visitors to the city for the next 28 years. Then, in 1999, the city purchased all the lines and property that belonged to the railroad. Most of the rail system, the tracks and the scaffolding, was torn down, and only the part of the trestle over Front Street remained. However, that was becoming structurally unsound, and in the very early days of 2000, a few months after the city celebrated its sesquicentennial, it too was removed, much to the sadness of city residents. Not only had Marquette lost the last sign of a rail system that had shaped downtown, but it also lost the one structure that welcomed everyone who came to pay us a visit.